welcome to Taf's Opinion. I am Taf and this is Taf's Opinion on Supporting Family Financially. <sighs> so, I'm the first one of my family, my family, a family of three, my sister and my younger bro. And my family is a very young family. My parents are super young, they just turned 50. It's amazing, it's a good plan, right? Now, a lot of my friends ask me, how do you do it? You're the firstborn, you're a girl, you've been working since we can remember. Don't your family feel entitled to your money? So somebody actually used the word black tax. Do you feel like you're paying black tax when you know every month or every other time you have to fix problems at home? So this was my response. And this is my opinion on this topic. It's a whole conversation that we can have for days but for now i'm gonna keep it short and simple one communication this is like my rule for everything people need to know what you can offer what you cannot offer when you can offer it when you cannot you choose it's a choice right i have a choice i can choose to help my family when i am able to i can choose to not interfere with their problems if I'm not able to because I'm an adult and I have my own problems as well. So I had a discussion with my parents because at some point in life I didn't have that line between is it my responsibility or is it something I'm doing out of the willingness of my heart. At that time it felt like I owe them. I have to do this. They are my family, you know. They've brought me up. Blah. Then I had my sessions with my therapist and I came to a conclusion that no, 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 no. It's not my responsibility to take care of anybody that I didn't give birth to. I choose how to be involved in my family's situations, right? So from that moment, I had a discussion with my family and I was like, I will be able to help when I can. If I can afford to do it, I will do it. If I cannot, I'm sorry, but you are adults also, please figure it out. I know it sounds really arrogant sometimes, but if you don't set these boundaries with people, you'll end up being the stressed one. You'll always carry everybody's load. It's very hard, especially when you're a firstborn, to just watch people go through stuff. You know, you want to take their burden and fix it. You cannot. There's only one life you're responsible fully for. Your own. And if you have a child, that child's life. My parents brought me to this planet. I didn't even ask for it. But that's a story for another day. So I got here and, you know, grew up. A lot of things happened. Now I'm an adult. I'm figuring things out. The least I can do is help them when I can. Not because I am expected. The society theory of, oh, you're in Nairobi living the best life in the city. You left your family in the villages and they are suffering. First of all, why are they suffering? Is it a situation that they can't get themselves out of? Is it a situation they got themselves into? Is it a situation I got them into? There are so many things that get people suffering, right? So for me, when it comes to family, I help, but only when I'm comfortable enough to do it. Because as much as I'm in the city, I'm working my ass off, it's because I'm trying to get my life in a certain way, and I'm not about to live miserably because my mom or you know my dad has chosen this month let me just you know not do much my daughter will come through no man we are adults sometimes we have these conversations and i keep reminding my parents also i'm also trying you know to have a better life than the life you gave me also you need to figure it out we are all adults it's not bad it's not you're not helping it is your helping but on my terms I'm helping on my terms. It's not on anybody's terms. So if you're feeling the pressure of, oh my God, I owe them. I need to make sure they are okay before I can even start doing my masters. Why would I do my masters, for example, if you know my mom is not stable? Mm -mm. Your mom is an adult. They can figure things out just the same way you're figuring them out. And that is my opinion. I help, but on my terms always on my terms be you my sister be you my brother my dad my mom it's on my terms this is what i'm capable of doing don't imagine 
this is how much she's earning so i expect every month i receive this amount no i earn this much because i'm working for it and i have things and plans for my own life if i want to include you in my plan i will do that you don't demand for it so have these conversations communicate let people know you also have a life to build for yourself and you will help and you can help when you're capable all right <laughs>